all right guys welcome back and in this video we're gonna see how we can create sliding options with ionic so so far we have just created a dump list right here but let's just make it a little bit more exciting so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna replace this array.fill with the array we created above and right here we can just say this is the element and the key could be element dot name right so we have a name for every person and the description for that so what i want is an ion star as well so this would be our image right so let's see what options do we have available on this one and you can see these are all just typical options so if you're seeing a uh you know this tool pretty much in front of that just it's most probably that you are not going to use this option with this particular thing right because these are just jsx html attributes so you don't really want to use them so anyway what we want to do instead is we want to have an image right here so i'm going to have an image right here which is going to have the src of this particular uh, of this particular person the image of that particular person and these images are in such a way that they're name is basically inside that particular image so the url for that is basically this right and we're going to replace this with element dot name dot do lowercase right so once we do that <coughs> we're going to see that we get these three guys right here so once we have our images up with us we can add iron label to it right so ion label would contain the description of these guys so we can just say element dot description right here and i'm going to see this just says just like that we can have some little bit of styling as well if you want but for the most part it's just going to work just fine so we can just throw in an h2 here as well which would be the element dot name right and yeah that would be all i guess and if we zoom out a little we can actually just throw this inside h3 right and we can just give it a you know class name of ion padding so that this applies a little bit of padding to us and you can see it kind of looks okay okay ish right so what do we want to do now is you want to make some sliding options now for that what we need to do is instead of ion item we want an ion item options right here with us right so we need some special treatment from ionic for this particular thing and actually not ion item options because this is going to go right here we would need to have ion item sliding instead right so iron out item options would contain the options which we should have and it should have the side of end right so once we do that we're gonna see that we have a little bit of things going on here and what we want is an ion item option with us saying hello and finally to put things into correct order we're just going to wrap it into ion item as well so that our main code is inside the ion item and our options are inside the ion item options so the structure looks something like this ion item sliding would hold our uh, item for that particular list then we would have all our content inside the ion item then we could have images you know some sort of text some description and some some helper text as well if you want right so this would just go ahead and work just work out just fine and then finally we can have our options now these options would have a particular side and we can customize that side as well but for now you're going to see that when i slide it to the left you're going to see we get a hello right here right so if i have this at start you're gonna see that now I have to slide it right here, right? And on the left, there's nothing, but on the right, if I slide it, I get a hello. So you can probably add a delete or something right here. And you know, you can just have an on click, 
listener here which just says alert pressed pressed delete right so once you do that you're gonna see that if i go ahead and delete this you get we get the alert press delete so yeah that's pretty much how um list in ionic works and how you can add sliding items with ionic and uh, yeah that's pretty much it for this video if you liked it don't forget to subscribe thank you for watching and i'll see you then in the next one